morning, you guys. Uh, just doing the final touches to the, the handle on Albert Jones's knife. Uh, I tend to finish off, or well, tend to do most of the, the shaping of the uh, the handles using the machinery. Got a coarse grit on this at the moment, and I just ripped it to a, a rough shape. But there's some little sort of corners and crevices, and where well, you've got to be careful and and. Uh, and you want to go steady and slow, so you can't beat hand and eye in a file uh, for, the, for the sort of final tight little curves, etc. And finishing off, and then you know, I've got to then go down to um, finer grits uh, and then polish and treat the handle. It's a particularly nice wood on Albert's knife. It came from. Um, the other side of the world. Uh, it's called Figured Bella. It's very, very hard wood, uh, so it should be a very stable, durable handle for you, Albert. So you've got my own uh, homemade mosaic pins in it as well. So black fibre liners. Uh, so I think it'll be a nice knife when it's finished. So I've got a bit more work to do yet. The sheath's uh, about halfway built. And at some point later on toward the end of, the end of the day, I shall have it all finished, I expect. And you'll see that then. So thanks for, for watching, and uh, so I'll, um, I'll be uh, filming progress throughout the day on this. Well, Albert, I'm just waiting for uh, the dye on your sheath to dry. So whilst it's doing that, I'm just going to have a go at um, starting on your matching fire steel. This, uh, this wood, very, very hard wood. Very hard. You can really see the, uh, the two-tone in that block of uh, wood, beautiful wood. X marks the spot. I just uh, drilled the, uh, the slightly larger diameter hole for the fire steel and a slightly smaller diameter hole for the brass lanyard tube. They all line up perfect. It is done. It is done.